Welcome to Horton's Fish Market. It's all fresh fish. I catch all my own fish. Um, I I've been commercial fishing since 82. That's Jeff Horton. He and his wife Tammy just opened the fish market back in August where they sell fresh fish through the week. Then on Fridays and Saturdays, they light up the fryer and serve fresh fish to hungry customers. You gotta serve it the way you wanna eat it. I think it, the catfish is, is the best it ever been right now. It's, uh, if you trim it right, it's good and clean tasting. It, a lot of people complain about muddy tasting fish, but you won't find that here. Rodney Biggs is a regular at Horton's. He says the fish sandwich at Horton's is the best, but you better get here early. So on Fridays and Saturday nights when the restaurant's open, it's, it's always packed. I mean, uh, you, you can't beat the food, anything, and, and it's, it's all good. What do you think, Beard One? I Beard Two? <laughs> Approval number two. After the judges finished, Jeff brought out his favorite sandwich covered in buffalo sauce and coleslaw. It's called the Oscar, named after his late grandfather who was a huge influence in his life. So many flavors from so many corners. Delightful. So whether you order the Oscar or the regular catfish sandwich, Jeff's goal is that everyone walks away happy. Yeah. I mean, everybody that comes in here really likes the fish, yeah. you know. So hopefully I'm putting out the good stuff for them, and they're all happy. <laughs> in Vincennes, Indiana, Mike Latta, News 10. We chose the large bobbers. Yeah, yeah. The Oscar, Oscar looks good, <laughs> real good, better than these do. I'm going to be help if I had pierced ears. <laughs> uh, well, not... Oscar does look good. So two finalists down and one to go. So who's going to close out the finalists for tomorrow? We'll find out together tomorrow. Mm -hmm. It'll be decision time for our judges as our newest Fork in the Road champion will be revealed right here on News 10 First at 5. Maybe we should keep these bobbers around because we may need them. We